hello guys welcome to my youtube channel ui ninja so in this video i am going to discuss the concept of css starting from its basics so what is css css stands for cascading style sheet it is used for styling and layout of the web page and control how your web page looks it helps the web designer to apply style on html tags so what does css do you can add new looks to your old html documents you can completely change the look of your website with only a few changes in css code for example css selects paragraph text setting the color to blue how to use css css is generally applied through rule sets a rule set is a combination of selector and declaration block so what is selector selector indicates the html elements you want to style it could be any tag like h1 s2 s3 and p tag etc and next is declaration block the declaration block can contain one or more declarations separated by a semicolon example is color red and font size 20 here color is a property and red is a value here we use two declarations declaration contains a property name and value separated by a colon so what is property a property is a type of attribute of html element it could be color border text line etc and values are assigned to css properties in this example value red is assigned to color property so next is css syntax first we use selector in the braces we use property and its value for example p is a selector here and color is a property and red is a value so we can add number of property and its value in this example p element shows a red color and font size is 20 px so we use this first we take one example open the sublime text editor first and we start code with style tag first we use style tag in between that we use selector first like p p is a selector and in the braces we add property and its value like color is a property and value is red and we can add number of property and its value here like font size is 20px and next we add text line attribute text line is a property and center is a value and next we add text decoration this is a property and underline is a value save this code here we add p tag that follows this property and its value so here we add some content save this file and see the result on the browser window all the properties shows in the p tag like underline font size color is red text line that is center so this is the example of css so thank you if you like this video so please like share and comment and subscribe my youtube channel ui ninjas so in next video we will discuss about different types of css selectors thank you